Welcome back to Wasteland 3, folks. We are heading in to meet Charlie, who we have sold out to uh, to the Monster Army. Uh, let's see, what do they have for weapons? Um, he has... Is that a rocket launcher? No, that's a heavy machine gun. That's a... Looks like a shotgun or a melee weapon. I can't really see it. Uh, assault rifle, I think. Heavy machine gun. And I have no idea what Charlie has. All right. Oh. There you are, Red Hats. Glad you could join us here. Opportunity awaits. You ready to take the bazaar with us? Uh, what's the plan again? Flab knows about your plan. We're here to make sure you never threaten this place again. What are we waiting for? Let's take the Pissar. Not yet. Give us a, a moment. What's the plan again? It's brilliant in its simplicity. The monster army is weak, but rich. All we need to do is knock them out, get rid of Flab, and we can take over. First we take the entrance, then we go down and wipe out anyone who doesn't surrender to the new cartel management. Hmm. Uh, we're gonna attack. Flab knows about your plan. We're here to make sure you never threaten this place again. Is that so, Red Hats? Shaman has to come to this. Boys! Get him. Yeah. Alright. You see ya? You're gonna need some cover. Move up here. Uh, where's Charlie? He's there. 13 armor, 12 armor. 16 armor, 12 armor. Okay. I wonder what weapon Charlie has. Let's do this thug. Defend. Uh, Jody. Actually, let's get Hawken. Where can she go? Let's send her up here and take cover. Ambush. Then Seuss. Actually, let's do Marshall Quan. Four action points. That means he still can shoot. We could also throw a frag grenade. Let's throw a frag grenade. That didn't do much. Let's defend. Jody, if you come out here, you don't have... Do you have cover there? It doesn't look like it, but you can hit everyone. Nice! Good hit, Jody! Seuss. Five action point, but leaves you with six, which means you still can shoot. I wish I had the torrent strike. Ninety-four percent. Jody, you defend. Cello. We don't have any cover here. I would do here. No, we don't. Can't get in there. Dang it. Uh, let's come down here. And I think what I'll do is I'll precision strike this guy in the body to take out some, uh, some armor from him and defend. Taking shelter. All right, Hawk is ambushing. Nice, nice. 
lot of blood. Ow. That thing hit hard. Taking the six. All right, there's a saw pop. Who's he demoralizing? All right, the goat is doing short work of the saw pop. That's the saw pop gone. And then we can hit him. Let's try and hit him in the head. Oh, oh, bury me. Ah, I, I meant to switch to the other weapon, damn it. Alright. Alright, he's down. Defend. One. Heal up, please. And then shoot. Oh. Charlie's dog, Charlie's dog. Charlie is back there. Let's shoot Charlie. And defend. Lucia. Defend. Hawk. Oh, that, this was Jody. Dang it. Alright, never mind. She hit him. And did some decent damage. Alright. Defend. Seuss, only 38%. Only 40%. 80% over here. Oh, there's also this guy. 48, 53. Hmm. What if we moved over to this side? 47. 13, 40. You know what, come up here. Pretty good hit. Pretty good hit. We'll defend. Taking the six. Oh, Lucia. That hurt. Alright, the goat is gonna go at Charlie. Nice hit, goat. couple of times. Nice, he's dead. The uh, hawk. Damn, he's out of range. Seuss. Eighty percent over here. But it leaves him without enough points to shoot. One. Thirty-six percent, forty-nine percent. It's not great, is it? Jody, sixty-six percent. But if we precision strike him in the head, wow, he didn't die. He has nine health left. That freaking sucks. Uh, Hawk, and Hawk can't hit him, so. Hulk, get Lucia up. Lucia, can you hit him from there? No. Okay, Hawk. I guess you're coming up here. Oh, he's stunned. Nice. Oh, 
so you got hit hard again. Right, Charlie's down. Six percent from there. I'm kind of liking that. Okay. Six. You can shoot twice. Come on, defend. Lucia. Can't really do anything. We do need to heal again. Mm. Ambush. Jody. Good hit. Not good enough, but good hit. Oh, get in here. Alright, I kind of figured that was going to happen. Alright, he's stunned. Good. Alright, hold. Get him up. Who's uh, that? Oh. Can you hawk? Can you smack him? You can. Rest in very hostile takeover. Return to Flab inside the bazaar. Alright. Let's loot this place first though. Money. Uzi money. Ken's shriveled drunk. Uh, ooh, nasty. That's Ken doll's uh, balls. Uh, one. Uh, everything, everyone is reasonably fine. Uh, pick lock failure. Uh, we have a lock pick seven. We have a lock pick ten. Acquired some nerd stuff level seven. Okay. Uh, chalkboard. This it's only only the electronic safe. Is there? What's that? The plan outlined on this chalkboard is simple, yet effective. Uh, step one, kill them all. Step two, party. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's see. Nerd stuff. Uh, who has nerd stuff? You have. You only have nerd stuff five, though. But we have... a nerd stuff thing. So that's nerd stuff six. And do we have a book? Do we have a book? If we do, I'll use it. Uh, first aid, hard ass, sneaky shit, falling, uh, weird science. We don't. Damn it, we need one more nerd stuff. And you were really close to leveling up. Dang, dang, dang. Because you're only at nerd stuff. No, that's nerd stuff seven. Four, five, six, seven, yeah, it is. Cool, let's pick the lock. See what's in here. Spike collar. A spike collar made for a mad dog. That's you. You're the mad dog. Crit resistance plus 5%. Okay, cool. Uh, an MP grenade, an Uzi, some ammo, some money, a cylinder choke, and a titanium crest. Well, we'll take it all. And now you get your badge back. Alright, 
And there's nothing else in here, right? Nope, nothing else in here. All right, let's head back to Flab, I guess. Because we have a reward coming. I thought I'd feel bad about Charlie, but I really don't. <laughs> uh, I I am annoyed that we didn't get his pass card, though. Mm -hmm. I am annoyed that we didn't get that, because that means that we might have to deal with the slavers, which I really don't want to do. Anyway, let's talk to Flab and get our reward. I really wish that his key card was there. I think we screwed ourselves a little bit with Charlie. At least with having to help the slavers. If you're looking for guns, the sanctified Piscatelli has the best. Okay. Always a pleasure to see the heroes of the bazaar. Right. It's done. Charlie's dead. We'd like to know more about you. Can you tell about what's bar? It's done. Charlie's dead. Eliminated with the correct amount of prejudice, I hope. Thank you, Rangers. Here, a reward for your efforts. 290 money, but 30% discount with the bizarre merchants that's actually quite nice be bizarre. We'll be waiting. that's actually really nice dogs dr cold cut can yo what else yeah ah you again what is it yeah pig human <laughs> ain't so different <laughs> cash first and i'll fix you right up all right he doesn't give us a discount <laughs> though won't hurt a bit promise Oh. Ah, the self-medicating sort. Sure, take a look. Yeah, but you don't have the medical stuff that I need. All right. Quan has leveled up. Gear here. Uh, let's see. Attributes, Quan. You have strength four. Uh, in order to use the tank armor, it takes strength six. You have... Strength five. I think I want to give it to Seuss. Alright, uh, Quan. Well, we're not putting it into anything because I want sneaky shit maxed. So, do we have. Um, do you have this one experience bonus? We have toaster repair. All right. But we do have a book for sneaky shit. Right? Yeah, sneaky shit. All right, so we'll save up. We'll get sne that sneaky shit and then we'll read the book with uh, with Quan here. And his attributes will get his coordination up to max. And we'll, I think we'll have a chat with Gwyn Hello. here. Welcome to Talbot's Tannery. Kind of depends on who's, that's why I'm here. She has some pretty nice stuff. Hmm. Armor plus two. Armor plus two. Armor minus four, but a lot of resistances. Combat speed plus armor four. Armor plus one. That's actually not my, not bad. That's not bad. A sensory shroud. Armor plus one. State of effect resistance plus thirty percent. Poly polysilylene barrier. 
plus one armor and a lot of resistances. Hmm. Uh, I don't like that. I don't like that. And I don't like that. Okay. Uh, I guess we have everything that we need here. So, what's Ooh, next? Hot to drink for the trip home. We'll come back on our way out. Guns sanctified with blood. Blood sanctified by guns. There's the slaver's bounty thing. Which I really don't want to do. Hmm. I think we're not gonna get Hallie back to her. That just doesn't seem like the moral thing to do or the ranger thing to do. Why are these exclamation marks on all of them? Okay. It's just because I haven't looked at them. Let's quickly do that so they're all gone. Because these are completed missions. Alright. So I guess next is Denver. Travel to Denver. I guess that is our next stop. So let's head out. All right. We're off to Denver, I guess. We are really off to, to Denver. We have ammo and everything, yeah. Alright. So I wonder what we'll find in Denver. Well, I guess it's, it's is it Valor or is it Victory that we're going after in Denver? Valor. Okay. So Denver is this way. Let's go. Enemy spotted. A robot wanders across the road ahead of you. Then another. That looks like a squad of them. At this point, you could give them the slip or not. Um, sneaky shit. Sneak up, up on them. Or avoid them. You know what? We're going to avoid them. Gonna avoid them. All right, that's the get homestead up here, right? Yeah. Let's head this way. Radiation isn't enough to hurt us yet. Oh, what's this? Oh, there's a uh, something there. Cash. Find a half bird. Cash. It's unlocked. Open it. Not bad. There's some good stuff in here. Uh, purifier tar and a control chip. And a red dot scope. Oh, the red dot scope is at least useful. What's this? Titanium plating. Okay, there was a lot of stuff in there. There's a deer. Uh, is there anything around here? Doesn't seem like it. There's something. Is there something there? No, no. Well, we, we want to go to Denver. Doesn't seem like these places are anything, really.
Okay. Turn of tarts. We we'll go this way. We can. But we need to go this way. But, but this way looks interesting. Ranger Command calling Team November. Uh, got something strange for you. Found a list of pre-war military radio frequencies here at HQ and started checking through them. All dead except one. Don't know if it's a hoax or a trap or what, but I thought you should hear it. Up to you if you want to respond. The signal originates near your current location. Anyway, I'll patch you through. Okay. Okay. Uh, Desert Ranger Team November to Morningstar, we read you, but who are you exactly? This is a Desert Ranger Team. If you're in trouble, why are you broadcasting on a frequency nobody uses? Desert Rangers? I'm sorry, but before I can reveal anything about myself, I have to know who you are. This frequency is for authorized United States military personnel only. Are you authorized United States military personnel? It sounds like he's a robot or something. Uh, the Desert Rangers are descended from the 253rd Engineer Battalion of the Arizona National Guard. Is that close enough? The United States doesn't exist anymore, but the Desert Rangers uphold the law in Arizona. We serve the Patriarch of Colorado, which is about as close as you get these days. You are either a joker or not. We don't have time for, for either. Goodbye. Uh, uh, the Desert Rangers are descended from the... One moment. One moment. Well, either you made an incredibly lucky guess, or you are who you say you are. All right. I guess I'll have to trust you. I guess you will. I am... Well, I hesitate to go into detail, even on a secure channel. Let's just say I serve America and everything it stands for. While on assignment, I became trapped in an old military facility near Denver. I cannot disable the facility security from within, but I can guide you to where you can open it from the outside. How did you get trapped in there? What kind of a name is Morningstar? It's a silly question from someone named November. <coughs> Fair enough. Uh, how did you get trapped That's in there? Mm. Tell us where to find you. Thank you. This is a matter of life and death for me. I appreciate your concern. If you can find Denver's Union Station, then I can guide you the rest of the way. Keep this channel open, and I'll contact you again. Please, find me. Help me. Morningstar, out. Okay. So I guess we have a mission. Uh, call to action. Chief call for help. Look at the entrance to Union Station. Okay. We're heading to Denver. What's that? Up there. We hear Union Station. Okay. Denver is up there. All right. Union Station is right here. There it is. So next time, we'll head in and find out what's going on at Union Station. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.